Many of you asked me on LinkedIn, what is a community center and what kind of community center would we have in Muscat? So there's not really anything like that here in Muscat, which is unfortunate. So this is kind of why I want to cover that. All right, so I'm gonna share my screen with you. All right, so back home in America, where I'm from in Wilmer, we have a community center. No, not that one, sorry. Maybe, uh, yep, this one. Yeah, okay. All right. I think it's this one. That's LinkedIn. Sorry, guys. Let me just go through. I thought I had it here. Maybe. I oh, there you go. Okay. So, community center is a place where the community can uh, relate and experience life together. All right. At a community center, um, it hosts many different types of seminars, celebrations, meetings, wedding receptions, and more. Also, their kitchen facilities uh, can accommodate catering services and individual rooms are available for rent. All right, so this is the one back home. So mine's going to be really small compared to this one right away, but it would be something like this. Usually the rents that they're asking for in US dollars, is about $60 a day. All right, and a day would we have to look at the different hours and what your event would actually need. Now, if it's $60 a day and we're looking at a span of uh, a day would be in our community center might be um, 12 hours. Okay, so for 12 hours, not a full 24 hours, but a, like a full, yeah, because I would need, I would need the community center as well because I would be giving classes. So we might have to do it per hour and not per day because I would need the community center as well to do my, my own classes and consultations and stuff like this. Okay, so you, we do would we would rent out rooms to the community and it would not be very expensive. Um, also, they might have like, to see how they have a senior dining where they set up meals for the seniors and, and ask for a $5, which is something similar to two reels per meal and meals are set, served Monday through Friday at 11.30 at the community center, okay. Sometimes they use it for wood shops, like how to teach carpentry or do wood carvings, okay. It's $5 daily pass, membership is $60, okay. All right, so events and activities calendar would be what's happening this month and what time is our activities you can go to C in their online cat calendar. Okay, so let's see here. So they have rental or rent reservations, league, league schedules and standings. They have a youth league, an adult league. So this could be in football. All right. Because, uh, you know, there's a lot of organizations that are out there, but we have a community center youth league or a community center adult league. Recreational, um, we have community center, auditorium, a playground, golf course. All of these are connected to the community center and they provide many type of activities. All right, parks and recreations. So if you go to the community center, it comes back to this page. Um, basically, let's see if we can look at this a little bit better. Uh, events and account activities calendar. As you can see, there's a huge community center. Let me see if I can bring this in. Let's see. So it says here um, that you can see that this day, the community center has Veterans Coffee Social. 10 a.m., they have the Gentle Yoga. 11.30, the Senior Meal. 12.30, they have Bridge. People come together and play Bridge, play card. Nine of evening wood shop, um, check needs chess club and barbershop practice. Barbershop, not barbershop, but like um, singing. All right, they might have a gentle yoga, 
the concert series, city quilters, concert quilters. Looks like they have afternoon dancing, Farkle Fridays. I don't know what that is. Okay, mocktails, beverage making class. It's a class. Twirler Square Dance, um, Community Board Game Day, Ticket to Ride, Picking with Riley the Dumplings. They have an art club, $5 for five classes, pencil and sketchbook. Um, community Kids, okay. They have a... So you can see it's a bunch of different types of classes that the community puts on. Now, it's not just one teacher that teaches this. This is the community decides, I want to teach this to our kids early. In a while, we might be like, I want to teach uh, boys how to tie their, their muster, okay? Or how to wear the kunjar, or maybe it's traditional dress for guys. Ladies might decide to teach about traditional dress for girls. And as you can see, this is this month. This is for January. All right, it might change. Then we have special events. We have Wednesday music concerts. Who are the ones that are doing the music? Afternoon of dancing. That's the beverage class. We've got January 15th is, this says, I don't know what that is, Cold Bounty, and a board game day, and a whisk tourney. Okay, the square dancing is $5. The community crafts is 12. Bingo and grandparents and Mario Kart tournaments and Kart. So they've got all these different things that people put on. And then of course you call or email and you tell them what you want to do. So basically a community center in Oman would be similar to that but we're starting smaller. This, they have at least many rooms. If you look at their rooms that they have, a uh, room set up, they've got a room for uh, a big room, a big room for like weddings. And this is for, like I said, meetings and trains and baby showers and anniversary parties and receptions, discussion groups, community gatherings and luncheons. And so they charge uh, $100 a day to use the, the room and staffing costs. Okay, the next room is a cell big room, and it's got a stage and a big place to dance. And you've got larger party, family event, dancing, music event, meetings, trainings, bridal, bridal or baby showers, and birthday party. You get the sunshine room, and the sunshine room is a little bit smaller, and it's got garbage can, coffee pot. Great for meetings, trainings, bridal showers, birthday parties, discussion group. A Reynolds room, okay. And a pool table space. Like I said, this is a lot bigger than what I can offer right now. Maybe the size of my rooms is similar to this room, the Reynolds room, and the Sunshine room. So they're doing $60 a day, and we do that into reels. I always use coin mill, okay? Mm, let's say 25, just to be, okay. Yeah, it's about $60, so 25 reels a day, okay? But again, like I wouldn't charge per day because I need the space too. All right, so, um, based on the classes I would have. So in the community center though, if you were to get like a community center activity and you wanted to put one in there and you wanted to bring your, your party in here, the only thing I would do is charge you just for the room rate. I wouldn't charge you for anything else unless you have us like make your food or this type of thing, then I would have to charge you for food price and hourly. Now I'm not a gourmet cook or anything, but I can make macaroni and cheese and I can make spaghetti with garlic toast and something simple like that. But if you're looking for a barbecue and everything, I, I guess you could use our grill, you know, once we get one and this type of thing. But that's basically what a community center is. And again, I said ours would be very smaller than that to start. But another thing nice about community center is 
It's run by the community, not by Ms. Marissa. All right, so maybe someone will come in and as soon as the community center gets grows and grows and grows and grows and grows, basically pays my rent each month, <laughs> okay? Then I would consider moving out and letting this whole area that I'm renting be the community center. And I, I would find a different place to live. So um, this is kind of like what, what, I'm, what I'm thinking about when I say community center. We really need a community center in Oman. We really need a place where we can all come together and have a, a great sense of development of our community. Okay, so this is what I'm talking about. I hope that's helpful. Again, I haven't decided on the charges for the rooms or the per hours or whatever like this. I'd actually have to talk to my partners about that. But again, this is what my idea about a community center is all about.